Hey everybody and welcome to another video here on Living Room Gear Demos. Today I'm going to show you all my guitars and I'm going to tell the story behind them starting with the first one or actually not the very first one because I don't have that anymore but the ones that I have I'm going to play them all for you. I'm using my Hampstead 60 RT artist and I'm doing a clean tone and I'm doing some overdrive with the 1981 drive yes uh, the first guitar is my uh, Fender Jazzmaster uh, American Vintage 62 reissue from what I remember I bought this guitar in 2002 uh, me and my dad drove to Sweden because back then you could save some money on the currencies and uh, yeah we couldn't find it in Norway so we ordered it in Sweden and we drove there to pick it up and it has been with me ever since it's my first if we can say proper guitar I had some uh, cheap strat copies before this one so this was my first proper guitar electric um, it has some uh, natural wear uh, I have some unnatural wear on different guitars but this one is uh, all natural and it still sounds and looks amazing to me and I will of course never sell this guitar. So let's hear it. <laughs> This is my Gibson ES335 satin finish. Uh, this guitar I would guess is around 12-13 years old. I actually got it as a gift from my dad. Uh, he had been working not abroad but on a different part of the country and uh, you could buy stuff there tax-free. So uh, I had been looking at uh, semi hollow body guitars for a long time and I w was like totally surprised when I got this for Christmas uh, 13 years ago and uh, it's been with me since then of course I have changed uh, the pickups uh, right now there are two humbuckers from PD guitars here in Oslo uh, they are really nice sounding I think I've changed uh, these and don't hate me for this but I also sanded down uh, the neck uh, because I didn't like like the glossy feel it had before so let's hear it So 
something like that. Okay, so this is a Fender Baja Tele. I bought this when I worked at a guitar store in Trondheim, I would say maybe 10 years ago. Uh, I think this uh, guitar was released back then. I remember the staff there loved these guitars uh, and I think at least a few of us bought one each and I sold a lot of them because that was my favorite guitar in the store. So it was so easy to sell. And I have like tried custom shops from Fender that couldn't compare to this guitar. Uh, I think I've said this in a video before that I don't think the new Bajas are as good as the first uh, run. Uh, and yeah, it's just a lovely guitar and I should uh, use it more. I don't use it enough. Here's a guitar that you probably have seen before if you subscribe to my channel. Uh, I tell the whole story of this guitar in a different video that I just made. So I think I linked that up there and you can hear a more detailed story. Uh, yeah, let's hear it. As with my fan out, check out the other video and there's the whole story behind this guitar as well. I just installed my favorite pickups ever and that's the Lawler Firebird style mini humbuckers. And here is how it sounds.
here is another one from TMG. Uh, a couple of years ago, uh, one and a half year ago, I was craving something uh, Les Paul, uh, late 50s. And I talked to Jonathan from TMG. He is a very nice dude and he hooked me up with this guitar. It's called Cashmere. And I think this might be the guitar I play the most this year and I just love it. Um, I use it for everything uh, rock and roll and heavier stuff. It's not too hot, it's just like perfect punchy, like a tally on drugs, steroids. So let's hear it. I made a video on why everyone needs a baritone guitar. You can check it out here. Uh, this is the one that Dan Electro sent to me for that video and it's just awesome. Awesome. So here is my Strat, it's from 85, it's made in Japan, it has a big headstock, it is cool, I bought it maybe six months ago, before that I wasn't really into Strats, I talked about that in the video where I unboxed, unboxed this uh, guitar, been using it. Uh, quite a bit after I bought it. It's really nice to have a Strat in your arsenal and this one is probably the best Strat that I've played. Uh, you can probably find a better Strat if you want to but this one works just fine. how that goes. One more. Uh, yeah, I got this guitar when I demo it. I got it as a gift 
and um, I don't have anything against it. I think it's a cool looking guitar. I haven't used it that much. We'll probably bring it on some trip because that's what it's for. Yeah, let's see how it sounds. I could not remember it sounding that good. So that's a surprise. All right, that's my guitars. I also have uh, one acoustic and a couple of lap steels, uh, but that is for a different video. Uh, what's your favorite one that I have showed you in this video? I wanna know. And yeah, thanks for watching this long video. Check out my merch store. I have sold maybe four t-shirts thus far. I would love to sell you some more. And yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye, see you.